Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedia again. Today we're going to keep working on our Pro Tools uh, video tutorials. And today we're going to learn how to cut time in Pro Tools. So cutting time is one of those uh, features or uh, operations that you're going to use a lot once. Um, let's say that you're, you have a mix, okay? And there's a label involved um, and they want a radio, radio edit or radio mix. So it's very common to have a an album mix that contains the whole song, let's say a five minute song, but then for a radio, you're constrained to a certain amount of minutes and seconds, so you have to cut the song. And when I say cut the song, I mean like removing certain parts and things like, for example, you know, if you have like a the ending chorus, if it happens like three or four times, maybe you wanna remove two of those or maybe even three of those, so it ends up being only one chorus at the end. So basically, once the whole song is finished, uh, if you're trying to shrink it and basically remove parts from the song, and when I say parts, I mean on every single instrument, every single track, that's when you're going to be using this function and you're going to find it very useful. So here we go. Um, let's say that we have, like for example here, I have this Pro Tool session and we have one, two, three tracks. There's a piano track with some MIDI information and a couple audio tracks, kick one and kick two. Let's say that we have we want to get rid of these two bars. Uh, sorry, these two beats from this bar. So uh, you can basically, if you're in grid mode, click on the timeline and drag the area that you want to remove. So in this case, I want to remove uh, from measure one, beat three, till measure two, beat one. I want to cut this time. Okay, I want this to disappear, basically cut it, delete it, and then whatever's after that, uh, drag it to that position. That's cutting time. So how do we do it? Very simple. Once everything is selected, you can simply go event, time operations, and then click on cut time. Um, event menu, time operations, cut time. You're going to see this cut time window. And it basically tells you the exact same thing that you just did. Like we just made a selection and you can see a selection that starts in measure one beat three and it's going to end on measure two, beat one. And that's exactly a length of two quarter notes, or two beats in this case, so that's good. Now, uh, once you cut it, well, before you cut it, you have to select if you want it to realign only the meter um, ruler or the meter, tempo, key, and chord rulers. Uh, my recommendation, if you're going to cut it, I'll just do everything. Um, so once you press apply, boom, it cut it the area. And whatever was to the right of that area, it dragged it to that point. So with a single click, we just cut it three tracks and joined the two sections. So that's cut time in Pro Tools. Um, I hope this tutorial was helpful. If you have any other questions, please call us from Obedient PC Audio Labs and we're going to be happy to help you. We will see you guys soon. Bye-bye. Want to learn how to produce music using this or using that or using all of these? Have you been watching videos, reading manuals, blogs, and trying to figure out everything that it takes to be a music producer? Do you have a bunch of music gear that you purchased and you still haven't made any music? Well, then you need Obedia, the world's only one-on-one -on -one digital audio training and tech support service. Check out the link below for a special new subscriber offer.